I have written you guys hard the entire season, and we've talked about one thing, that you get what you earned. You earned this. From the time we started playing districts, you came and you practiced hard and you played hard and you deserved this. So this was our goal before the season started. Repeat champions, you guys should be proud of yourself. It only took three pitches for the Marlton 12-year-old Cardinals to finish off their state championship game Wednesday night. The bulk of their 7-4 victory over Sacred Heart was played Monday before the Storms. Seems a long time ago now that the Cardinals were down 4-1 and facing a bases-loaded one-out jam in the second inning. That was the moment they brought in pitcher Brian Clock to put out the fire. Well, I just really wanted to come in and keep throwing strikes and pounding the strike zone and maybe get them off balance a little bit with my off speed pitches. The first inning I came in, we got that big double play, and that really set the tone for everything that went down afterward. Go, go, go! Kyle Fisher singled in a pair of runs in the home second, and Josh Bridgers followed with an RBI hit that tied the score a moment later. And while the Cardinals' bats were heating up, Clock was shutting the Angels' bats down cold. He struck out six over four and two-thirds innings and allowed just two hits. The Angels didn't get another runner as far as second base. With two out in the fifth, Anthony Schooley's grounder was misplayed into a two-base error, and Zach Cowley came to the plate. There's a dude on second, and I kind of just swung as hard as I could, and it went out of the infield. Felt good. I had to hit a strike on me, so I mean, I was kind of just swinging at anything in my zone. When it came off the bat, what did you think? I thought, uh, kind of, my body kind of like filled with joy there, and I, I just, I like, I loved it. There was more to love a moment later when Justin Ward sent this tape measure blast over the left field fence for a 7-4 lead. Clock struck out two in the top of the sixth before the storm started, and 48 hours later, the Cardinals recorded the final out and finished off their second straight Southern New Jersey State Championship. For the Burlington County Times, this is John Lewis.